Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. We are live and direct, ready to make some cold calls here. Got everything all set up. We are in my remote virtual office, the car. So let's just get right to it, guys. We're going to be doing some uh, circle prospecting around a listing that the brokerage that I'm calling for recently sold. So we're calling around a listing that sold for uh, 1.7. Please leave your message for three two three six four six six eight zero seven. It's always weird. Thank you for using the voice messaging server. Goodbye. Calling somebody else's voicemail to be able to enter your voicemail. That always sound seemed odd to me. I don't really know how that works. Let me open up the stream here, see if you guys have any questions while I'm calling. You'll see a link to the Rookie to Relevant Realtor resource. We have 37 members in that group. The first 100 will get a free coaching call for my cold calling training program. Bear with me, I was just feeling a little bit nauseous. So, just taking a little bit of a breather. Um, nothing makes you feel better though than when you're cold calling and you get some results. You know that will cure that will cure cancer for me. 
so I'm just gonna push right through it so we're doing just listed calls I mean I'm sorry just sold calls so we're calling around a listing in Pasadena that the brokerage that I'm calling for recently sold for 1.7 million and so we're calling the neighbors that live in that neighborhood to see if there's anything that we can do to help them now or in the future Don't leave voicemails unless I know it's the right person. We're using the Red X three line dialer, so there's three numbers being called right now at the same time. These are as cold as these calls get. Super cold calls. I never spoke to these people before. I'm calling them without them expecting the call. We have reached the voicemail box of 8183847894. And I know nothing about them besides their name, their address, and their phone number, so this is as cold as it gets. Sixteen fifteen South Los Robles. All right, hang on while I try to reach them. Sorry, they can't take the call right now. Thanks and goodbye.
Like I said, I got a little bit of a stomach ache, so we'll see if the Pepto helps. This helps too. This property that I'm calling around, it's a 1.7 million and it's in Pasadena, pretty close to the Rose Bowl. your message for marketing alike and if you're a realtor go ahead and join my public group the first 100 members are going to get a free coaching call uh, specifically on my cold calling program you'll have to excuse me i uh, a little bit nauseous today which is why i'm not talking so much to the camera i'm just going to focus on the calls Beautiful day here in Sacramento. Give me just a moment, I'm sending this stream to a few people on Messenger.
connection. My hotspot's acting a little funny today. Put a post on Instagram real quick. We are making live cold calls here on Facebook. There's a link in the bio. Come hang out. Lots of dials, guys. Lots and lots of dials. Please leave your message for eight one. I probably make you know I make at least five hundred calls or more a day, five hundred to a seven fifty. You know, um, you know it takes lots of dials to be able to even have conversations, and then the conversations are going to be able to you know create eight leads and then one. appointments. But guys, it all starts with dials, and I can't stress enough how important the follow up is. Because sometimes it takes that second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth conversation before you're able to actually convert stuff. And when I say convert, I mean to an appointment even. Because that's what my clients hire me for. They hire me to, to set up appointments for them. So sometimes it takes a few follow-ups, emails, and texts, right? Especially with for sale by owners and expires. They may not be ready to meet right away yet. That's the right number, so let's call back because it's the right name. Hi, you have reached the voicemail of Rankin Repetti. Please call me back later. That's all right. Hi, can you hear me? No, tiene mal número. Wrong number? Okay. Wrong number! I know a little bit of Spanish. Those days when you're not feeling so great, those are the days you don't take a day off. You just keep going. Please leave your message for 626. Six. The days that you don't want to be calling, those are the days you should be calling. Hey Patrick, this is Jeremy calling you from Carl Markarian's office here at the agency. Wanted to give you a quick call about 1415 Lomita. When you get this, if you can give me a call back, just had a couple of questions. 
Again, it's Jeremy calling you from Carl Markarian's office here at the Agency Real Estate Brokerage. not speaking. Press 1 to record your message. Press 2. Come on, Red X. Are you still there to disconnect? <clears throat> I'm going to plug in my power cord. I have one of these inverters to where I can plug it into my, uh, my lighter thing, where the lighter thing goes, and then I can plug my laptop cord in so I can get power from my car battery to charge my laptop when it goes, when it starts dying. Because I'm preparing in the spring, I'm going to be making a, a nationwide virtual tour and I'm going to be working as I travel. And so I'm slowly gathering up stuff to be able to work like a virtual nomad. Hi, this is Jeremy over at the Agency Real Estate Brokerage. I was calling about your uh, property on Lomita. Uh, we don't own a property on Lomita. Uh, 1485 Lomita in Pasadena? My ex-wife owns that, but not me. I see. I apologize. I was calling because we recently sold one of the neighbor's houses, and I was just seeing if there's anything we can do to help. I will make sure we don't call again. On to the next one. Harold? Who? Is this Harold? No, you had a wrong number. Oh, hello? Okay. You had a wrong number. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. On to the next. Who answers the phone? They're like, hello, 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 hello. Who does that? Hello. 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 Yeah. Yes. Calling about your property on Euclid. I was calling about your property on Euclid. Excuse me, I yes. don't understand you. Yes, I'm Not calling I'm calling about your property on Euclid in San Marino. Do you own a property on Euclid Avenue? Do you own a property on Euclid Avenue? Excuse me, I don't understand you. It's okay. Have a good day. On to the next. Especially when calling SoCal, man, I wish I knew, like, Spanish for sure. Maybe a few, like, common European languages. 
I do not yet, but Spanish would be huge. So if you guys speak Spanish and you want to help me with my Spanish, we can make some sort of a barter. I'm willing to work something out. You need to get one of those uh, laptop stands for your car, you know, like uh, cops have. What's up, Melissa? Melissa Bradley. <laughs> I'm glad I can amuse you. send a text however that's not the name of the person that we're looking for so I don't want to do that Hi, Bryn. Hello? Hi, is this Bryn Allison? Um, no, you got the wrong number. Oh, I was calling for John or Bryn Allison about 1650 South Euclid Ave in San Marino. Mm, no, you got the wrong number. I apologize. Do you think I have the wrong number, guys? You think I got the wrong number? Wrong number? 
<laughs> On to the next. Sorry, the person you are trying to reach has a voicemail box that has not been set up yet. Please try your call again later. Goodbye. All right, guys, I'm going to end this live stream for now. I will check back with you later. If there's anything that I can do to help you with your real estate business, hit me up. This is the life of a virtual inside sales team. J Marketing, we call you close more real estate listings and also power prospecting. If there's anything I can do to help you with your real estate cold calling, let me know. I have a training program that will get you to a high level of cold calling. If you're a realtor who's already killing it and you're looking to delegate the cold calling to a service like mine, we can talk about that as well. Have a good day, guys.